Sisters. Good evening, everybody. I'd like to call this seat a regular meeting to order with roll call, please. Board Member Van Gordon is still here. Board Member Weber here. Board Member Mo here. Vice Chair Radley here. Board Member Blackwell here. Board Member Doyle here. Chair Pichonary here. And Board Member Lemo. Yes, here. So, we go with the uh, consent calendar. We're um, doing the announcements. Go can you just say Okay, I move with approval of the consent calendar. There no items on the consent calendar. That's why we're Last time I thought there were no items that I didn't do it, and this time I'm like, no, I didn't do my one job. So. Okay, so I'd like to keep it. Uh, Make an announcement to there are, two, there are two times designated for public testimony this evening under business from the audience and public hearings. If you are attending in person, please complete the request to speak card located at the city recorder's desk in the Jesse Main room and turn them into the city recorder. If you are joining online with a tablet, smartphone, or computer and wish to speak either at either of those times, please use the raise your hand feature. Uh, the order of public testimony is as follows. Uh, anyone in person goes first in the Destiny main room. And second, anyone who has raised their virtual hand will go second. Is there any business from the audience or is there anybody attending from the audience? No, we do not have any cards. We can give folks a moment to see if they want to raise their hands in the virtual meeting room. Let's see any hands for business from the audience. Thank you. Um, I have nothing. I don't see any correspondence. Is there any business from the staff need to cover? It's new business. Okay. I have nothing to report. No report from committees. So we'll go ahead and start with the public hearing. Uh, Neil, take it away. A supplemental budget three. Sure. You have two public hearings tonight. Public hearing number one is fiscal year 23 supplemental budget three. That's resolution number one. A resolution adjusting resources and requirements in the following funds. CETA Glenwood General Fund, CETA Downtown General Fund. And uh, Neil Obringer is here for the time. Good evening, uh, board members. Uh, so this is your final supplemental budget for the current fiscal year. And really, there are just two items uh, that the supplemental budget addresses. So in the Glenwood Fund, we have um, an adjustment to provide for issuance costs for the, the recent borrowing in the Glenwood District. Um, and then in the downtown fund, we have the uh, repayment of the interfund loan from the city to CETA. So that's uh, provided for now, and that uh, draws that balance down to, to zero. Um, so I'm happy to try and answer any questions you might have, uh, but keep it short. And um, I'll just request that you uh, hold the public hearing um, and then uh, take action on the resolution. Is there any questions before we? Yeah. That was kept short. Next. Okay, so we're going to open up the public hearing. Uh, we have no cards. We'll give folks another moment to raise their hands if they want to speak on this first public hearing. And I'm not seeing any hands from the side. Seeing no one closing the public hearing. I move that we adopt resolution number one. Seconded. I moved and seconded. Uh -huh. All those in favor signify by an aye. 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 Any opposed signify same. I think carried unanimously. Next item. Your second public hearing in fiscal year 2023-24 seat of budget adoption. This is resolution number two, a resolution adopting the fiscal year 2023-2024 Springfield Economic Development Agency budget, making appropriations and directing the division of the property tax. Um, Nathan Bell is here for this item. All right. Uh, good evening, City the Board. Uh, the item in front of you this evening is a request to conduct a public hearing on the fiscal year 23-24 uh, CETA budget as approved by the Budget Committee, and then to adopt uh, or not adopt a resolution adopting the fiscal year 23-24 Springfield Economic Development Agency budget, making appropriations, and uh, directing the division of the property tax. Just a little um, context here, too, uh, this evening is on May 9th, the CETA Budget Committee met uh, to consider the fiscal year 24 uh, budget as put forward by the city manager, Nancy Newman. Um, at the end of that evening, uh, they recommended that that budget come forward as uh, put forward with one minor adjustment that was requested by staff. That was to uh, move the parking program out of the uh, CETA budget and into the city's budget. 
So this budget is as presented with that one minor adjustment. And with that, I'm going to turn it back over to you, Chair. Okay. Any comments? I guess we'll have to wait. Open up the public. Um, we have no cards for this item. We'll just give folks a moment. I want to raise their hands for this item. I'm not seeing any hands from the same. We're seeing no comments. We will close the public comment and request a motion. I move that we adopt resolution number two. Second. It's been moved and seconded. All those in favor signify with a aye. 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 Folks signify same. Very unanimously. A question uh, for, uh, for the city attorney's office. Do we need to specify the uh, the motion as far as um, making the appropriation? And do we need to spell that out? Or are, you, or are we good? Well, she, it on the yeah, he's, he read that verbatim. Okay. At the beginning. Okay. So okay. we should be Thank okay. Thank you. I was much for that. So uh, carried unanimously. Next item. If there's any, any new or old business, seeing none, this meeting is adjourned. So you're right.